Hi everyone, Happy New Year. I'm Anjali Peralt, and in today's Creative Parenting How-To, I'm showing you how to make this string art masterpiece that'll keep you inspired all year long. The downloadable PDF that I've created for you today reads, You Are Loved. This is a phrase that my husband and I chose for our family's New Year's resolution because we want to be reminded daily that every single moment we get to spend together is a treasure. And because we all like choices, I'm also going to throw up on the website this second PDF, just of the word love, that you can download as well. It's a much simpler string art project to execute than the one that I'll be demonstrating for you today. The materials you'll need for this project are a stained 12 by 12 inch block of plywood, your printed quote, one to five colors of embroidery string, a hammer, about 200 three quarter inch finishing nails, needle nose pliers, scissors, tape, and white craft paint, and a brush. Let's get started. Step one is to tape your text to the plywood. This piece of paper is a template that you can hammer your nails right into. The goal is to hammer around the black edges of the script lettering to create an outline of nails that you'll be filling with string later. As you can see here, I'm using needle nose pliers to hold the nails in place as I hammer them. If you're using a simpler template, then using your fingers will work just fine. Once all of your nails are in, trace over the block lettering with a pen using enough pressure to inscribe a dented line into the wood. This will be the template that you'll paint over later with white paint. Then just pull off the paper template and use the needle nose pliers to pick out all the little scraps that get stuck between the wood and the nails. Now that you've got your lettering done, a helpful step is to outline all the nails with red string to define the edge and make the outside edges more visible. And this is when the fun starts. To begin filling in the lettering with embroidery string, tie the end onto a nail with a double knot. Then you can go crazy connecting all the nails to one another in a random pattern using the string. joining me today and until next time let's stay connected stay creative and most importantly stay inspired i'll see you soon